Sharper Point Commentary, presented by Schwartz Laser Eye Center. People in Arizona like to talk about honoring our pioneering spirit, especially conservative politicians. But one thing that Arizona pioneered after the horses stopped being our primary mode of transportation is something that conservative legislators want to get rid of. Whether you call it photo radar or photo enforcement or a red light camera, calls to kill off the cams that detect our speed and whether we run a red light have been raised since we first pioneered them way back in 1987 when the town of Paradise Valley became the first place in America to use photo enforcement vans to monitor the speed of cars on their streets. PV saw such a dramatic decrease in the number and severity of collisions, they expanded on photo speed enforcement and added cameras that detect red light runners. So many other places in Arizona followed suit. But Arizona State Senator Justine Wadsack wants them banned. Her town, Tucson, canned their cameras in 2015. She claims that when red light cameras were first put in place, the old Pueblo actually saw an increase in crashes. So she told ABC 15 she's glad that Tucson saw through what she calls the scam of red light cameras, which she also claims is basically a money grab by the government. Wadsack is sponsoring a bill that if it's passed and signed by the governor would outlaw these cameras statewide. But that is not very likely because Governor Hobbs vetoed a similar bill that she sponsored back in May, even though Senator Wadsack says nobody wants to drive down the street and know that big government is able to look at them while driving. You know, I'm not the biggest fan of speed cameras, but they don't, nor do red light cameras, which I kind of like, trample my constitutional rights because there's no reasonable expectation of privacy in public. The government's not allowed in my car without my permission, reasonable suspicion, or a warrant, but taking pictures from outside my car isn't unconstitutional. I don't like being held to 40 miles an hour while traversing Paradise Valley, but that town has more millionaires than any place in Arizona, so their cameras are there for safety, not money grabbing. Plus, how can you argue against red light cameras? I mean, people who don't give a damn about the color of traffic lights and they just run right through red lights should instantly get eight points on their license and lose the right to drive and maybe even have to do time as a crash test dummy. Thanks for watching Sharper Point. Click to see more from Arizona's morning news and tap the button in the middle to subscribe.